Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And on today's video, I want to show you how to format a USB flash drive to FAT32 using TransMac. So just in case something happens to your Mac laptop, you can just format the USB flash drive and just re-download the operating system on there. So basically, all you're gonna to have to do is you just plug in your USB flash drive to the laptop. It's easy, guys not hard at all and I suggest you get at least like a 16 gigabyte of storage or a 12 gig especially like once you format like the OS to the flash drive so it's best to get something like that you know all right you plug the USB flash drive to the laptop but first you have to download let's go to the website you it's it's called acutesystem.com you go to their website and you can download the free trial and the free trial lasts for it runs for 15 days from installation, but if you want to purchase the <clears throat> the whole version, it's 59 bucks for single user license. So once you download the free trial, you will have it on your computer, on your desktop, as you can see. So basically, all you have to do is that you just click on there and open it up. Like as you can see right now, for me, days left for evaluation. I have 10 days left. Because I've been using this already. So once you open it up, you just have to wait. And once it finished saying wait, you just click on run. And you're going to open it up and you're going to see it just like that. Let me zoom in a little bit so you guys can see what I'm talking about. All right. It's going to look just like this. And it's going to show it's going to show the flash drive, which is a lag sausage jump drive, USB disk. So you right click. And you go to format disk for Mac, click on that. But it's going to ask you about the administrator privileges as required to access the disk. Do you want to restart Transmat? So you click on yes. And then you click on yes again. And now you're going to have to, now this time it's opening it up as an administrator. So you just wait till the clocks run out. Then it's going to say run. So you go back on there again. All right. Let's see now. Okay. You go back on this and you click on format. This for Mac. You click on yes. And the volume name, you can just type in anything. I'm going to just type in Mac OS. And you click on OK. And it says about to overwrite 15 gigabyte drive. And then it gives you the name. Are you sure you want to continue? Click on yes. And it says formatting drive. So this should take, it shouldn't take that long to format. And once it's done format, I'm going to show you how to get the Mac OS, how to flash it to the USB, which is simple. But it takes like, it takes a little bit longer because, you know, it's flashing the whole thing to it. All right. So once you, once you format the um, USB drive, now this was going to pop up on your window PC. You need to format the disk to use before you can use it. So we're going to click on cancel, exit this out, and it says format complete. So boom, the format has been completed. Now for you to load like the OS onto the USB drive, you right click, then you go to restore with disk image. You click on that. And it says this this may contain mounted PC volume restoring overwrite. Are you sure you want to continue? You click on continue. Then you select the disk from your storage. Mine's is in document. As you can see, it says Mac OS X Lion Bootloader. And it has to be a DMG. The file has to be a DMG. So you click on that. Let's open it up. You click on open. And it's gonna show it right here. And then it's going to click on OK. Then it's going to say this is a compressed DMG. It will be decompressed on the fly. And it's going to tell you it's about to overwrite. And you click on Yes. And now it's formatting the drive. So basically what it's doing is it's formatting the OS into the USB, USB flash drive. So once, once it's done formatting, you just, you know, you open up your Mac. And you can just upgrade whatever software you have on there. So let's say if you have Mountain Lion and you want to upgrade it to High, C High Sierra, you can just put High Sierra in there on the USB flash drive. 
and then just upgrade the software from Mountain Lion like that, which is easier to me instead of doing it on the Mac, which is sometime you have problem upgrading it from the internet on the Mac. So that's the best way. So we're gonna let this finish format and it's going by pretty fast, but in this, I'm, I'm formatting what? Mac OS Mountain Lion. So let's say if I'm doing high Syria, that would have take a little bit longer because it's, it's more gigabyte. But since Mountain Lion is like what, four gig? I think the file is like 3.93 gig or four. It should be, you know, it should go a little bit quicker. So we're going to give it some time and just let it format. And once it's done, it should be it. The Mac OS now is flashed to your USB flash drive and you'll be good to go. So if you have any problems, that should solve your, you know, that should solve the problems. So that's basically what I wanted to show you how to format your USB flash drive to no using transmac so thank you for watching this video and i hope this video helped you out a lot and if you have any questions or you know anything you want to ask me just drop a comment and i'll get back to you and i'll catch you on the next video thank you so much